I, you say you're doing it by yourself, right? But we can't ignore the ties that you. Can we even talk about like you ties? For with, sure. You, you t- ties with YSL. For sure. Right. So can it? You can't. I can't ignore it. Like you can't. Listen. Out of out of every artist I ever met, them they've been the most genuine. You feel me? So mm-hmm. it's like you can't ignore what they've done for me. And if you look, if you know what's been done, mm-hmm. you feel me? But as opposed to, like I said, I've been doing everything myself. Like even when I was with them, I dropped Happy Halloween Four. Like Slime was slick blue with me because he like, man, we had family discussions before we dropped that music. But I didn't know. Like you feel me? But he pulled me to the side. Like twin, we we talked like as a family before we before anybody dropped. Like mm. next time you drop, just come let me know. We gonna okay. work it out together. Type okay, shit. okay. Like that type shit. So it's like. It ain't just a nigga around trying to get a dollar off a nigga or some shit like that. It just, it felt like family. So that's what it is. They, them, them niggas brought me to a, a bigger space, bigger platform, put me on my first jet, everything. Put me put me in front of a, a lot of shit for the first time that I ever seen. Freedom. So far as, uh, of course, free wide. So, so as far, far as um, you doing it by yourself, though, was it that you skipped those conversations of like, yo, we need some help on the business side? Did you or did you miss that or it was it wasn't never that it was just more so like I've been stuck in the same way for so long doing it by myself it's like You're used to it if if you if you if we both doing the same thing we gonna chop it up about what we doing but it's like we really don't got time we so tunnel vision and used to having to handle everything on our own so we're it's not that we don't want to it's we don't know how to ask mm-hmm. we don't know how to walk up on a nigga and be like damn bro how you do this or what you think about that? Or what you think about that? You feel me? So it's just like, it was just, it's just that. Like, the business. But they they helped me with the business. Like, they was telling me what to do when it came down to the business. They taught me about taxes and all that shit like that. Like, Gunner and Thug really taught me a lot, bro. Like, for real. Just... So that whole situation kind of, did it, did it slow up what you had going on? Because it was like, that was, your shit was going uphill and then they get booked. Nah, not really. It's like, because at the same time, I've always been my own entity, even though I was with them. So it's like when I when 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 I got with them, my shit jumped up some more. Okay. When they got locked up, my shit jumped up some more because it's like you the last one of you feel me. You yeah. one of the last that's still here that was with them before that was really with them before they left. So it's like we want to see is you gonna hold it down for the family. So it's like for, for shit show, I'm gonna hold it down for the family mm. like for sure. Freedom. Is that, do that. Is, is that just just honestly right? Like when you go in the house. Is that kind of like scary? It's like, man, I'm gonna hold it down, but like at any given time, this shit could come down on me because like they try to get the whole camp out here. Explain that to me. It's not that, bro. It's like the way shit looking is like, it's like they coming home. Mm. All that shit is some bullshit that's just misconstrued. So it's like at I came around at a point where. I I didn't never I never see none of that. Okay. So it's like it, it if that the shit that they accusing them of, I, I ain't saying. ever see. So it's like when we was we making music, we on jets and you know having fun at parties and shit. I ain't ever see nobody do no. You feel me? We a family. We ain't ever run into no problems to even have to do shit like that. So mm-hmm. it's like I ain't ever see that shit. So when I came, it was at a it was at a pivotal point, as, as opposed to the shit was already in the works. I get what you're saying. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. And that's just how it happened. It's just like... It's but that, just... I mean, it's still... I get it, right? But it still could be scary, though, because it's like, bro... It's kind of like, hypothetically, right? I hope it's not a terrible analogy, but like Kanye West, right? He say some shit, then everybody, they just cut ties with him. Right. So kind of saying, well, why sell? They associate why sell with X, Y, and Z. So because people don't want to be associated with X, Y, and Z, they cut ties with why sell. And I'm trying to figure out, did you ever think like, man, this shit could really blow Fuck back no. on me? Hell no. Nah. No? You cut ties with me. You cut ties with YSL. You cut ties with me. It's fuck you. We gonna. I been doing it by myself. Mm. You cut ties with the family. You cut ties with me. I'm just gonna have to go around you. It is what it is. Like it ain't nobody that's gonna be able to tell me like, oh yeah, you gotta stop saying free them in order for me to fuck with you, or you gotta not be around. Or you got gotta block them. Uh, man, fuck out of here. Like mm. man, hell nah. We not doing no shit like that. Nah. We just gonna have to go around you. It is what it is. We gonna go over you. It is what it is. You getting stepped on. You can't. We just can't do that.